All right, it's time for Fooey's Small Stars this week. We're heading to the gym for some eight and nine year olds playing basketball. Another early Saturday morning at the gym, and this week it's the Savages in purple against the Golden Bloopers in, well, gold. For a lot of us, getting up early on a Saturday morning isn't the easiest thing to do, but that's not the case for Darian. It actually feels really great being playing basketball, and I'm happy that people are playing today. And with that, the players line up, get their assignments, and we're off and running. The action is fast, and the shots are dropping. And before you know it, it's halftime. So we go straight to the players to get a quick review of the first half. It's just hard to beat them. We have to run around a lot, so if you play a basketball, you better have speedy legs. When asked what the score is, Dougie and Mateo don't hesitate. Uh, I think it's tight. I'm pretty sure it is, but I'm not positive. Good, pretty good. I'm pretty sure we're winning. After a quick water break, but before we get back to the game, Darian has a few words of advice for it. It actually feels really great uh, playing basketball because people actually get a chance to do something for life and not be lazy or bored. In the second half, Dougie catches fire, sinking just about every shot he takes. So Dougie, what happened out there? I did closer shots, so it's a little easier to get it when I'm not guarded. So I tried to shoot as many of those kind of shots as possible. Whew. And you know, when you played a tough early morning game, it can be exhausting. Just ask Darian. Yeah, I'm sweating. I feel like I'm going to go to Chick-fil-A and get a burger or something. Huh? Anyway, when the final whistle blows, the Savages win again to remain undefeated. Congratulations, Savages and Golden Bloopers. You're this week's Small Stones. Good job, guys. If you know of a young athlete or team you'd like us to feature, send us your name, your contact information, and a short little bit on who these kids are. You might just see them featured right here on ABC 15. Send your information to the address on your screen, smallstars at abc15.com.